Good morning. How's everybody this morning? Back again, we are on our Sunday school lesson. And remember, we're doing uh, making choices. We talk about Gideon, fearful, not sure if he could do what God wanted him to do, but he went ahead and obeyed God and honored God. Samson, making mistakes, but he went ahead and honored God with his life. Mary, I know that Jesus' feet, even though the perfume was so costly, expensive, she wanted to honor Jesus, and she wanted to give that to Jesus, no matter what kind of a criticism she got. And today... The title of our story is Jesus Answer the Ruler's Question. Let's pray. Dear Lord, we ask you to help us understand your word. In Jesus' holy name we pray. Amen. So, Jesus answered the ruler's question. A ruler came to Jesus and asked a question. Good teacher. What's my, what must I do to receive eternal life? Jesus asked, Why do you call me good? No one is good except God himself. You already know the commandments. Keep your marriage promises. Do not kill. Do not steal. Do not be untruthful. Honor your parents. The ruler said, I have kept all those commandments since I was young. You are missing one thing, Jesus said. Go and sell everything you have. Give the money to the poor. When you do, you will have treasures in heaven. Then come and follow me. When the ruler heard this, he became very sad. He was sad because he was very rich. Well, as you can see, young people, it may not be easy for some people to follow Jesus. But that is what it means to follow Jesus. If we choose to follow Jesus and make him our Lord and Savior, we must follow him, just like Gideon. Even though we don't think we're capable at times, even though we don't think we're able at times, we must follow him by being obedient to our parents, following God's rules, being a helper, being polite and respectful, showing compassion and kindness, sharing God's word, practicing reading the Bible, praying, worshiping the Lord. And today's verse, memorization verse, even though it's a little long, I'm going to read it to you and try to memorize it. But if, if, it, if it doesn't please you to worship the Lord, choose for yourselves today. Which will you worship? As for me and my family, we will worship the Lord. And that's found in Joshua 24, 15. So, may the Lord help us always choose to obey Him because there's great rewards. If we choose always to obey the, obey the Lord, we will have all those promises that He has in the Bible. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow you or shall follow me all the days of my life. 
Let's pray. Dear Heavenly Father, I pray for these children. I pray for every little boy, every boy that is watching this video, that you bless him and help them, Father God. Help them make right decisions. And especially that school is coming up. Be with them, Father God, and help them be honest and do their best in everything. In Jesus' name, amen. The Lord bless you and keep you. We'll see you next class. Bye-bye.